Maros Sefcovic é o novo rosto do Pacto Ecológico Europeu. O vice-presidente da Comissão Europeia recebe as responsabilidades do neerlandês Franz Timmermans na liderança dos esforços da União Europeia para alcançar a neutralidade das emissões de gases poluentes até 2050. Em entrevista exclusiva à Euronews, o político eslovaco disse que quer ajudar as empresas e os cidadãos a implementarem as novas leis. Until now we've been focusing a lot on the legislative work, so I think we build this uh, new political but also legislative framework for the Green Deal and, and now we are approaching the phase which should be equally challenging if not more and this is rollout, uh, this is proper implementation, this is how to make sure that uh, um, uh, this uh, climate transition will be done in, in socially fair way, that it will help our industry to be a top competitor. Do you know already how you're going to manage to bring on board industries? So I'd like to introduce like series of, uh, I would say, structured roundtable with the industries which would be the most affected uh, by, the, by the green transition, which are under a lot of pressure uh, from international competitors, also jumped on the wagon of, of, of climate change. And I think that also our uh, industry should know that we are here to fight for them. We want them to not only to stay, but to prosper in Europe because We've been uh, the first major economy who started uh, to tackle the climate uh, change with all the vigor. We have uh, excellent innovators, great companies, and I, and I think that uh, we have to work closely with our citizens and with the industry to make Green Deal reality and to really demonstrate that this is our strategy for growth. Four years ago, you said there was this, this feeling of urgency to act. Do you think the feeling is the same today, or do you feel this fatigue towards regarding climate change? I mean, non-action at this stage uh, uh, would be the worst uh, possible uh, solution because let's look at, at, at this summer. Let's look at the last summer. Last summer we saw was, was terrible. This summer was much worse and we just uh, can brace what would be the, the next summer's uh, look like if, if, we, if, we wouldn't, if we wouldn't act. And therefore, I think that we have to behave uh, responsibly, we have to be engaging more, and we have to work hard uh, to make sure that uh, uh, we would manage these three overarching goals, be socially fair, t tackle climate change, and make our industry competitive.